This is the town of the Board of Hennessy Trustee Special Meeting, September 28, 2023, 12.30 p.m. Town Hall Council Room. Roll call, please. Brandy? Here. Uh, Bert? Here. Cliff? Here. Harold? Dave? Here. Scheduled business to approve, I'm sorry, excuse me, discuss, approve, award, review, reject, and or deny any action on the following. A. Discussion with a possible action to approve the change order for the number one for REIT grant number KF23-2 showing the increase of $32,067.31 to the construction cost. Uh, I met with Jennifer, Tiffany, uh, the gentleman of the uh, engineer, and I met with the construction people, and uh, we had the water department there, we had some other people there when we met over there at one o'clock, and uh, what happened was is our map was wrong. And so they had to poke holes and look for different places. And uh, they, the uh, street people would say, hey, yeah, you, we got $2,000 that we can approve, and that's what it was. But what happened was they went ahead and had to put more cement and do that, and that's why this change order went to $32,067.31. Does that end the REAP grant for that project? Does that close it? Yes. Sorry. Sorry. Any questions? Mm -hmm. I don't think I have any. I make a motion to <clears throat> approve the change order number one for the REAP grant number. KF23-23 showing the increase of $32,067.31. I'll second that. Roll call, please. Cliff? Yes. Randy? Yes. Bert? Yes. Dave? Yes. So I have a question. Tiffany, does that allow us to, to now pursue a REAP grant that's due in September 30th? Yes. So this one will be closed that we can pursue. Okay. And that's why we had to meet here today, so we could get this done, so we could file for another grant. Can I ask you a question? Yes. Uh, is this just about the, the Mitchell Road and Third Street area? No, sir. It is not. What's it about? I never this is over on Dunlap. On Dunlap. Okay. Water Water line I have a question about the other one. B, discuss with possible action to approve pay application number two for the REIT grant K, number KF23-3 using local funds. Uh, again, at two o'clock, Tiffany, Jennifer, what? Is that wrong? This is, no, this is the same project. Oh, this is the same project? This is approving Oh, that we have to use local funds to do this. I apologize, I misread that, thank you. Thank you for that. Discussion with possible action to approve the application for the number two for the REAP grant number KF2323 using local funds. The reason why we have to use lo local funds is because we already used our grant money and the money that we put in. So this would be our money that we have to put in as a $32,067.31. Cliff, I have a question. Yes, sir. I understand what you just said, but I'm also looking at this current payment due is $110,138.25. Excuse me, sir? I'm looking at the application for payment, sir. Uh, Marsaw Enterprises, Dunlap Project. It's in the handouts. It says current payment due $110,138.25. I, I think what I heard you just say is what we're approving is the just the thirty-two thousand sixty-seven point thirty-one. Is that correct? Or yes, sir. Are we approving one hundred and ten one thirty-eight? Or is that a dumb question? It just looks to me like on the paperwork that it says first payment due one ten one thirty-eight. That's 
the change. I would assume that's the pay. Yes, we were already agreed to pay this part. So okay. if you add that figure of the thirty-three thousand. That. Okay, so we'd already voted on this 110, 138? Yes, sir. We did. Even though it appears to be changed down from 111. I'm I'm sorry, I'm confused on it. Based on the uh, based on the uh, line changes. I you know, I'm not saying I don't want to vote for the thirty two thousand. I'm just saying that it looks to me like they're billing us for hundred and ten again. I think that the balance of that come out of the grant, am I correct? The thirty-two is just what we're using out of local funds. Well, there were some of the some of the funds were local funds in the original contract, and so the thirty-two is additional local funds. Right. Tiffany, I, I didn't hear you very well, ma'am. So what we're approving today is the thirty-two thousand zero sixty-seven point thirty-one. That was the change order. Right. Now, to pay application is the 110. Okay. That includes the 32 additional that you did, plus some of the other contract that had to be, that was already approved okay. to be done. All right. Okay, that answers my question. Okay. Thank you. make a motion to use local funds to pay the $32,067.31 for construction costs. Oh, second that. Roll call, Are please. Are voting on the 110, Mr. Mayor? Yes, ma'am. Um, actually, the pay request is for 110, 138. So we need to do the 110. Correct. I thought we already opposed. The contract you approved, but this is actually making payment. So, like, they're requesting a payment of one hundred and ten thousand. Okay. The finalizes and it, ends the, the project, it's right? It's not the last one. It's not. No, okay. because they still have to get signed off on the project and get their retainage. So, right. but this is the payout number two. Like, okay, so the only thing we'll have left is the retainer. Pretty much the retainer, and there's just a few minor things. Okay. Do you have a proximality of what that would be? Um, I'm sorry, I did not realize that. So the retainage is around 6174. Um, the whole contract is going to be around 200 and let's see. The 24904. Eight, I mean, 804? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. 31. We've already made 130. So it's real close. It's going to be pretty much just the retainage. The $6,000. Thank you for clearing that up, please. Um, so I need to put... 110, 138.25. that there's numbers marked out on that is because we supplied them pipe and so we got them to reduce it by $344 for the pipe that we had supplied them. I make a motion to make a payment of $110,132.25 using local funds to pay grant Number KF two three dash two. I think it was supposed to be one thirty eight. One thirty eight. Yeah. Thank you. One thirty. One thirty eight twenty five. I'll take your name. I'll second that. Roll call, please. Cliff. Yes. Randy. Yes. Bert. Yes. Dave. Yes.
discussed with Apostle Ashton to approve moving the October regular meeting to a different date due to fall break. I was asked to put that on there, but I'm good with the Thursday of fall break. But that, if somebody wants to... That Thursday night is also the last home football game, which will also be senior night. Oh, I, don't, I don't know if that affects anybody. I'd like, Mr. Mayor, I'd like to discuss this. Go right ahead. I'm really not interested in changing it. I, I don't, you know, I'm looking at, I'm looking at our board members. I'm looking at, uh, uh, you know, I, granted there's some activities that night here in town, but I don't see any reason to change the meeting. Okay. That's my opinion. And never mind. I got some more comments on meetings for our next regular meeting. I'll do that then. Thank you, sir. You bet. Bert? Well, I don't know if that will, it won't affect me. Um, I don't know if it will affect any of the public that may want to come. I hate to. I hate to move it, you know, but yet I hate to have it if it's going to. If there are citizens that want to come, then I think we should have uh, moved it. I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm endeavoring. I, it doesn't affect me. The football game doesn't affect me at all. But I agree. If there are citizens that want to come and want to be here, then I, I want them to have that opportunity. So I'm, I'm getting that. Get rid of that there. I'm getting it that way. I'm going to be off. Cliff, one more comment if you don't mind. Uh, if, if you guys want to move it to another, a different date, uh, I think we should have that different date on here as part of the agenda item. Right. What are we going to do? Are we just going to wing it and make up a date here? Or? And we couldn't, we can't really pick a date before we have a meeting and decide what that date is. That's true. It couldn't be on the agenda until we, until we discussed it. Yeah, but we can't discuss things without it being on the agenda. Yeah, but well, it is on the agenda, but particular date's not the, the, because... The, the different date is not. We also wouldn't know what would work for everybody until we talked about it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What do you want to do, talk about it in the next regular meeting? <laughs> Our next regular meeting is going to be that meeting. <laughs> I understand. So we'll just keep the meeting as is. Okay. You don't need to make a motion to do that? Who's last? Me. Okay. We will leave the meeting as is. Executive session pursuant to OS section 307B1 to discuss the employment contract for the town administrator, Tiffany Tillman. One, vote to convene into executive session. I move to go into executive session. I have a question before you start. Yes, sir. Uh, one is, how many employment contracts does the town have with other uh, employees now? How many employment contracts? To my knowledge, none. Okay, do we have a contract, employment contract with our town attorney? No. Okay, so why, have an agreement. so why the rush on this one? There's not a rush, sir. It seems to me like there is. <clears throat> the rush for the meeting was to get this street grant closed before September 30th so we could pursue uh, another. No, what I'm saying is this part of the meeting, why couldn't it be on a regular Thursday meeting? I mean, everybody's off work right now to come here. And you're worried about a football game for another meeting. But you're not worried about us getting off work to come today. So I just think it's fair before you jump into things, you allow the public a chance to look it over, talk about it, and maybe put it in for the next full meeting. I'm not advocating yes or no. I'm just saying a chance to review it. Okay, thank you. I'd like to see, since everybody seems to be here on this contract, I'd like to see a show of hands how many live in city limits. 
Thank you. And there's more that couldn't be here today because they had to work. It also affects a lot of people that shop in this town. I was yes. going to say, we all spend money in yep. this town. All of our money goes here. My kid goes to school oh. here. <laughs> Pretty much, yes. Pretty much. I don't hardly ever go to Enid. I was just <laughs> The dollar store and the grocery store pretty much get all my money. The gas station. Yeah, that station. too. <laughs> and the gas. Roll call, please. Claire? I had some more discussion, Cliff. Yes. I'm not trying to interrupt or anything, but uh, uh, I, I sent you a documented email recommending a delay on this so we have the chance my, I guess my let me I, I wanted to let the public know that I, I sent you an email and recommended a delay on this and let me tell you why uh, I sent in and John can John has already told us uh, I sent in my inputs to the contract so what I want to know is are you guys looking to approve the contract today, or are we going to executive session to discuss the contract? We're going. To, I don't know if I can answer your question, but we're going to discuss the contract. Okay. Who knows whether it will I have no idea if it's going to be approved or not until we okay. come out here and make a meeting. All right. But we have not had the opportunity to discuss this at all. Right. I agree. That's, that's, that's part of my. That's part of what I'm talking about. Uh, most people don't know it. I think John knows it. I don't know if you guys know or not. But I put in at least 30 inputs to the contract. Yes, I am aware. It, it will take a very long time to go over just my inputs alone. And I also, John has also told us that Ms. Tillman had some inputs, so we'll have to go over her inputs also. And then John also said, John, correct me if I'm misspeaking mis 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 here. You also said that another trustee, I don't know who, has made some, at least one input. So we would need to go over that input. And then the contract would have to be wordsmithed again after we negotiate our way through all of these inputs. And John's going to have to have time for that. So I don't see how we can approve this contract today. Where do we start, though, David? Well, I agree with what you guys are saying. Let's go to executive. Where do we start? I'm going to vote start yes to go to executive point. session. Absolutely. I want to go in there with you guys. But I want to make sure that you understand that I want to go over everything, and it's going to take a while. And Cliff, I've heard a rumor that you got to be at work at 2 o'clock. Yes, sir, I do. So, I rec again, I recommend a delay on voting to approve is what I'm saying. But we need to go to an executive session so we can discuss this. We have not had the opportunity to do that. So Very good. We need to do that. I totally agree. I'm a yes vote on executive session as soon as you, as soon as you guys vote on it. Roll call, please. Cliff. Yes. Bert. Yes. Dave. Yes. Randy. Yes. to revene from special session. Second. Roll call, please. Okay, Cliff? Yes. Bert? Yes. Randy? Yes. Dave? Yes. E, discussion with possible action to approve the employment contract for the town administrator, Tiffany T Tillman. Does that need to be a motion to? I, I think you just motion, you move to continue okay. uh, this meeting. I move to recess this meeting and reconvene Monday at 6 p.m. I'll, I'll second. Oh, go ahead, Randy. Roll call, please. Bird. Yes. Randy. Yes. Cliff. Yes. Dave. Yes. Are you talking about this coming Monday? Yes. And, and then there would be no motion to adjourn because you're you're basically just continuing the meeting until Monday. And then if you finish Monday, you'll adjourn that meeting. Sure. So do I do the... Yeah. 
Town meeting. Let's terminate uh, this meeting, and then now you can open up your authority meeting. Okay. Town of Hennessy Utility Authority Special Meeting, okay. September 28, 2023, Second. at 12.30 p.m. Town Hall Council Room. Uh, roll call. Brandy. Here. Bird. Here. Cliff. Here. Dave. Here. Uh, discuss, approve, award, review, reject, and or deny action with the following. A, discuss with the possible action to approve change order number one for re-grant number KF232-2 showing an increase of $32,067.31 to the construction cost. I make a motion to approve the change order of $32,067.31. Second that. Roll call, please. Cliff? Yes. Randy? Yes. Bird? Yes. Dave? Yes. Discussion with possible action to approve pay the application number two for the read grant number KF23-2 using local funds. And that would is 110,138.25 is the payment on that. I make a motion to pay the 110,138.25 using the local funds to pay the grant number KF23-2. I'll second it. Roll call, please. Glenn. Yes. Randy. Yes. Dave. Yes. Bert. Yes. C. Discuss with possible action to approve moving the October regular meeting to a different day to fall break. We're not going to do that. Discuss with possible action to approve the employment of the contract for the town administrator. We're tabling that. Do I uh, turn? Well, I think we ought to. Uh, uh, continue continue the authority meeting also to Monday because if you do uh, approve a contract, uh, you'll need the authority approval also. Randy, could you do that for me, please? Yes. I'll make a motion to continue the utility meeting until Monday at 6 o'clock. A right. second. <laughs> Roll yep. call, please. I'm sorry. No, go, go ahead and change your vote. Uh, well, uh, what what I would uh, like everyone to know is uh, the board is not taking action today on uh, the Tillman uh, employment contract. <coughs> They're going to continue this meeting until Monday, and so you won't see another notice. Okay, so you've got to you've got to remember to if you want to. They need to state the or state the date, not just say Monday. Say Monday, October second. They haven't 2nd. done that yet. They're just saying Monday at six. Yeah. So, so it, Monday, it, if you want to continue to hear a discussion, you need to come at six p.m. on Monday, October second. Okay. Okay. Did Cliff second that? Yes. Yes. Okay. Randy. Yes. Cliff. Yes. Bert. Yes. Dave. Yes. 